Pulmonary embolism also called PE is a blockage in one or more of the pulmonary arteries in your lungs. PE is commonly caused by blood clots that travel to the lungs from deep veins in the legs, or, rarely, from veins in other parts of the body, also called deep vein thrombosis. Rarely, blockages can also be caused by air bubbles, tiny globs of fat, or pieces of tumor, that travel to the lungs. Why are blood clots dangerous? If a blood clot forms or gets stuck inside a blood vessel, it can clog the vessel and keep blood from getting where it needs to go. When that happens in the lungs, the lungs can get damaged. Having blocked arteries in the lung can also make it hard to breathe and can even lead to death. Most blood clots in the lungs actually form in the legs or pelvic area and then travel to the lungs. Because the clots block blood flow to the lungs, pulmonary embolism can be life-threatening. However, prompt treatment greatly reduces the risk of death. Taking measures to prevent blood clots in your legs will help protect you against pulmonary embolism. Common symptoms of PE include cough, shortness of breath, and sharp, knife-like chest pain when you breathe. Other signs and symptoms include rapid or irregular heartbeat, lightheadedness, or dizziness, excessive sweating, fever, leg pain or swelling, or both, usually in the calf caused by a deep vein thrombosis, and clammy or discolored skin or cyanosis. If you get any of these symptoms, especially if they happen over a short period of time, hours or days, or get worse quickly, call for an ambulance. At the hospital, doctors can run tests to find out if you do have a clot. Blood clots in the lungs can lead to death. That's why it's important to act fast and find out if there is a clot. What are the symptoms of blood clots in the legs? Blood clots in the deep veins of the legs, also called DVT are the most dangerous. Clots in the deep veins can cause swelling, pain, warmth, and redness in the involved leg. Blood clots in the veins near the surface of the skin, called superficial veins, are more painful and can cause redness or infection. These clots sometimes also cause the veins to harden and bulge into ridges that look like cords and is common in the veins below the knee. If you think you have a blood clot in your leg, call your doctor right away. Blood clots in the veins near the surface of the skin are less dangerous, but blood clots in the deep veins of the leg are more serious and are more likely to travel to the lungs. Is there a test to find blood clots in the lungs? The tests include D-dimer blood test, CT pulmonary angiogram, ventilation perfusion lung scan, also called a VQ scan, pulmonary angiography, and MRI pulmonary angiography. During this test, a dye is injected into one of your veins and can show if any blood vessels are blocked.